Hi guys, my name is Debbie and I'm an intuitive reader and I'm here today to give you your general uh, weekend spread for Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, March 15th, 16th, and 17th, 2019. Please keep in mind that this is a general reading, so if you are interested in a private one, all the information is down below in the description box. So whomever this is meant for, I pulled a 10 card spread, five above, five below. I did clarify the one card as well as pulling an outcome and I clarified that as well. So whoever this is meant for, you start off first with the death card. Death card is known for that transformation, that change, okay? In regards to, if you take notice, uh, literally trotting on over to the Knight of Cups. That Knight is that slow pace in regards to the cup energy, which is love. Now I did clarify it because you jump from the knight to the king. So from that energy, that tells me from slowness to being the man, you know, in regards to love energy here, okay? It's been a slow process, absolutely. But that slowness is literally closing, is what this is saying with the world card. Major kind of huge message in itself, literally turn looking at it saying, you're done being slow. Yeah, I am being done here. With I'm manning up now in regards to the energy of slowness to being the man. They are making this choice, this decision, literally turn with the two of wands here to end that, I just heard mental anguish, to end that mental anguish. That explains it because right after that is the five of swords. So take notice seriously to what they're both looking at, that completion. Somebody is making a decision to end mental anguish of going back and forth in their mind with that five of swords energy to come to that completion, that closure. Okay, they're moving away from their thoughts with the six of swords, getting out of choppy waters, especially with the mental anguish and being successful now with the six of wands, getting that victory. Look what they're being victorious over, being patient, okay, being patient with themselves and they're going to, it's kind of like, you know what, you did a good job. So because you've been patient, here you go. You know, we congratulate you. And you've been manifesting for this to take place with the magician here to regain this balance, all right? Now, this also represents to me uh, holding within, okay? Expressing how you feel, especially with that King of Cups energy. He's a cool guy, water sign you could be or you could be dealing with. But regardless, with to have the King of Cups there, he has a reputation of... Yeah, I love this person, but I'm not saying nothing, you know, kind of thing to this person opening up. This also represents that too, okay? And they've been torturing themselves, going back and forth, back and forth. Do I open up, okay? That is what I feel here in regards to somebody basically, let's do the outcome. You want to do the outcome. Two of Pentacles, feeling a little off balance with those Pentacles, one up, one down kind of thing. Looking at that one pentacle saying, hey, do I want a new start and balance? Yeah. Making that decision to get that fulfillment in regards to the Ten of Cups energy, which is that fulfillment of love. Okay. Bottom line is this. You know I always review. Uh, there, I sound like Scooby-Doo there. Uh, the death card is that transformation. Literally turn looking at that Knight of Cups there. Uh, for that slowness, somebody's making a decision after a lot of mental anguish of going back and forth in their head. What do I do? Well, I'm going to make that decision to close that chapter of that slowness and be the man in regards to the king instead of the knight now. They're moving forward. They're getting their success. Uh, they've been more than patient with themselves is what I'm feeling as well. But they've been manifesting for this. Uh, look at this. See, they've been manifesting in their mind. What do I do? Okay, is what this says to me. Well, I need to open up. Okay, I've been closed off. And I've been mentally anguishing myself to open up. And I feel that now somebody who has been a little off balance feeling after quite a slow process in regards to a love relationship here is now making that decision to close that chapter. Like this, seriously, this says that's enough. That's enough already with the slowness. I'm starting to man up now. That's what I'm feeling, regardless of gender. You know, that's just Mike saying. But that's what I feel with this situation, absolutely. Sorry, they're just talking. They were confused. They're saying, add the cups. I'm like, what? Yeah, the Knight of Cups, the Temperance card holds two. So that's three. So three minus the 10 for your outcome. This has been a very confusing situation. Seven of Cups, you got the Seven of Cups. So that's a very confusing situation. They're moving away from that, getting that victory in regards to what they've been patiently uh, waiting for. It's, uh, that's the weirdest energy. They've always wanted this person. 
but they were too conflicted in their mind. They were confused as to what to do. But now they got their balance together. They're manifesting properly. They've waited long enough for this completion of that slowness. They're making a choice now to end that slowness. Very nice. So somebody is definitely getting their balance back in and going for that completion in love. And that's what I have for whomever this is meant for. I hope that this helps. You guys have a great weekend. Enjoy it. It's going to get warmer. <laughs> I'm all excited about it being 60 outside right now. You guys take it easy. Enjoy your weekend, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.